bringing the video podcast for global Filipinos around the world. Watch and listen as we speak and get to know different celebrities, icons, influencers, and inspiring people. Join Jesse Dang and Jay Cass as they talk about anything and everything while bridging the gap between Filipinos of different generations and genres of choice. This is Over a Glass or Two. Ay, sorry, wala ko sound. Oh my God! <laughs> Oo oh, nga, nasa yung sound ni Direk. Nagkakapela kami ngayon. Yes, there you go! <laughs> oh my God! Ano ba yan? Ha? Oh my God! Kumusta po kayong lahat? My God, kumusta ka na, Jaycas? Ay, ito naman, mabuti. How about you, girl? I'm okay. My God, ano pa rin, malamig pa rin kahit spring na. And by the way, ah, happy third year anniversary po. My God, ang oh, over class or two ko, is three year years na. Tayo pala, happy third oh, anniversary, guys. Third year anniversary. Siyempre, sa third year anniversary namin, talagang pinili namin yung isa sa mga special talaga sa puso ng over class or two, which is si Miss Lola. Lorda Nicolas Luis. Diba siya ang aming special guest ngayong third year anniversary Tawag namin. Ano, leveling. Leveling lang Leveling. Yan. Oh my God. We're so, so excited. Anyways, kumusta po kayong lahat? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening po sa lahat ng mga nanonood. Especially sa mga TFC subscribers. I want TFC. Siyempre, diba? FYE Channel and Kumu, Facebook and YouTube. Ikaw naman, Jcast, go! Dito naman po sa Brooklyn. Good morning night po sa lahat mga Filipinos and non-Filipinos in different time zones, in different dimensions, in different continents, in different galaxies, in this whole wide universe! Rest, rest! My God, Jcast, uh, uh, ano, bigla ko na goosebumps, no? Imagine mo, for three years mo nang sinasabi ang verse, verse, verse na yan. Uh-oh. Maraming maraming salamat po sa lahat ng tumangkilik ng over a glass or two ng ogat tatlong taon na kami I cannot believe three years na hindi po namin alam kung saan kami mapapadpad aabot pa ba kami ng four years pero bahala na po ang Diyos bahala na po kayo Lord Tama. sa amin yes at alam mo Jekas kahit paano nag-elevate na rin tayo kasi imagine mo ngayon nasa FYE channel na tayo and also in ABS-CBN, the Filipino channel. Oo, kapamilya rin tayo, napansin tayo ng ABS-CBN and now we are, we are on the Filipino channel yes. and I want TFC Worldwide. Yes, maraming salamat sa lahat ng mga tumulong, sa lahat ng celebrities, sa lahat ng mga kaibigan naming tumulong para, of course, for, to, to make all these things possible, especially to Ate Star, di ba? Ate Star, maraming salamat sa tulong, kala, kay oh, Ate Pilar God Mateo, Mother. kala Dorothy, kala Wena, sa lahat yes, ng, lahat my God, there's so many people, kay Dos, may uh, sino pa ba si sino sino direct sabihin mo na si direct ay magsalita eh oo nga gumagana lang siya <laughs> maraming yun? salamat Baka maraming kumakain <laughs> oo nga eh kumaka- actually kumakain na ata siya kaya ganyan parang mo na yung mukha so anyways maraming salamat din direct of course maraming maraming salamat diba for for ano for uh, tawag dito for being so patient with ayaw us ayaw nga niya palagay sa poster eh, kasi Uh-oh. nilagay ko pinost ko na ayaw sabi ko hindi kaya ang ganda kaya kasi siya yung pinaka ma- Malapit sa camera. Buti <laughs> <laughs> ka sabihin, ma- 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 malapit sa camera. Hindi ko naman sinabi ko siya pinakamalaki yung face. Ano ba? I know. So maraming salamat po again dyan. sa lahat ng tumangkilik ng Overglass or two. And we will do our best, of course, na pasayahin pa po kayo. Um, at kung meron kayong mga uh, request ng mga famous celebrities or or papasok na celebrities na palang or and inspiring you know, people inspiring people uh, just send us a message and we will do our best to of course to have them guested or uh, guest on over a glass or two yeah Uh-oh. yan na Ex- syempre excited na tayo no my god talagang oh special tong ano na to itong araw na to third year anniversary and special guest ngayong araw na to so introduce ko na po okay all right we are so excited today to catch up and extensively talk to our dearest friend and now author of our wonderful 
travel memoir. Why should guys have all the fun? An Asian American story of love, marriage, and running a billion dollar empire. Billion lang naman, Jcas. O, di ba? Oo nga. Yes. We saw her a few days ago in her successful launching of her book at Barnes & Noble and Tribeca in New York. And now we're so excited excited to discuss about her book and more. Guys, please welcome the phenomenal lawyer, philanthropist, other successful businesswomen, no other than Miss Lorda Nicolas, Nicolas Lewis. Lewis. Thank you. Thank you. Maraming maraming salamat and congratulations on your third year and anniversary. Galing, galing. Yes. Maraming... Saludo ko. Saludo. Loko, saludo. I know. Yes. Actually, Miss Lorda, maraming salamat kasi ano lang kami, um, we were just following your footsteps. Correct. Diba? Sana, sana maging ganyan din kami kayaman and successful. Speaking of tenacity <laughs> and hard work, ayan. Yan. Pero tama ayan. si Jessie, sana lume- lumeveling din kami sa bank account. Oo nga. <laughs> <laughs> yes, hey, you're only three years old. I am 80 years old. <laughs> I cannot believe so, it, no? So you, it's coming. It's coming. Just expect miracles. Uh, Kapit oh sa Diyos, hard work, and set your goal. Lagi kayong may goal. And now, you are three years old. So yes, you'll be here in the next 30 years. Oh my God. From your mouth to God's ears. Ako, Miss Lorda. Hopefully, Lord, maawa na kayo. <laughs> Sana naman po. <laughs> Pagsatsagaan well, namin no. mangyari. <laughs> Look, dati, kung kayo lang sa Facebook, now you are with the Filipino channel, yes, ABS-CBN. Yes. Yeah. See, so congratulations. That is quite a feat because ima- imagine, Miss Loida, we're just really regular Filipino-Americans. We're not celebrities. Yes. And uh-huh. little did we know, and now we're, we're napansin kami ng the Filipino channel, and now we're, uh, we're being shown worldwide, di ba? Worldwide, yes. international na kayo in no. three years. No. That is an accomplishment. Yeah, so, it is an accomplishment. Yes. It is actually... <laughs> Yeah, yes. So, you know, look look forward lagi. Look Kaya, forward. Yes. Tsaka, ihingi kami ng mga tips sa inyo, Miss Lorda. Oo nga, kasi sabi na nga namin tatlo na uh, we have to follow yung mga inspirational people like you. They ba? Like, ask for guidance and tips kasi nga, I mean, kakaalang naman makinig kami dun sa mga people that who will trying to pull us down. So, you know what? We will just look forward and of course, kailangan namin ng mga guidance ng mga successful Filipino-American like you. Ayan. And, Ay, yes. and before we start, Miss Loida, say hi to, glo- uh, to our global yes. fans and friends. Yes, yes, yes. So, yes. yes, kamusta? Uh, magandang umaga, magandang hapon, magandang gabi sa inyong lahat. Okay, and God bless you. Oh my God. Si Miss Lorda, mukhang... Ba- nung nakita talaga namin si Miss... I mean, nakikita lagi namin si Miss Lorda. Uh, you know, sa mga different events, di ba? Pero nung nakita talaga namin si Miss Lorda, yung talagang harapan, yeah. during the book launching, sabi namin, oh my God, ang kan... Miss Lorda, yung sinabi ng 80 kay, years old? Kay, kay Jessie, sabi ko, si Miss ano Lorda, oh, ang ganda. Hindi, <laughs> Miss Lorda, ang ganda. Sabi ko, hindi siya mukhang yung, ano, yung, yung pure pinay para tal- may halo si ano, Miss Lorda. Grabe no. Teka Miss Lloyd, ano? Teka, sige nga bago ko tatanong to, yung anong sikreto mo bago mo ikwento. Um, mag-toast muna tayo Miss Lloyd. Syempre, yung parin yung kaeklata namin ngayon. Do you have anything to drink Miss Lloyd? Water. I was well, trying I was trying to do it, but I wanted to be on time, so I did, I was able to get. It's okay Miss Lloyd. Kami na lang magche-cheer sa inyo. Nagkakape kami ngayong araw na to. Oh, Ayun. Ako pala kape sa akin kombucha. Diba? Oh, kombucha. Ayun, masarap 'yan. Ayun. Sa sampayan ng Pilipinas po at sa aming dearest USA. Guys, let's all welcome Miss Lloyd and Nicolas Lewis. Welcome, welcome to, to Over a Glass, glass or, or Two. two. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah, Cheers. Ayun. Mm. Yes, happy anniversary. One, Maraming two, salamat. Yes. Ayun, no, tatlong, kaya pinili po namin talaga kayo ang sabi, ay naku, kailangan si Miss Lorda ang special guest namin ng third year. No? Para may impact, di ba? Para may impact, di ba? Ayan. O sige, picture tayo Miss Lorda. Tapos kwentuhan na. Eh. Okay, go. One, two, three. Ayan. Miss Lorda. Yun nga, Miss Lorda. Ituloy mo nga yung ano, yung, yung um, sagutin mo nga yung tanong ko is, what's your secret? Like, why do you, 80 years old, but you look so, you look so fresh and, Grabe, I don't know, very eloquently ka pa mag, magsalita. I mean, lahat na yung demeanor mo, very positive. Ang, yung mukha mo parang, nag, nag, parang angel nagsasign. Anong secret, Miss Lorda? Well, unang-una, narinig ko sa radio, nourish your face, hydrate your face. Sabi ko, hydrate, ibig sabihin yan tubig. 
So, bumili ako ng uh, plastic bottle, yung parang pang spray, all right? And I place drinking, hindi sa tap water. You know, you buy drinking water, uh, you know, Poland Spring. And then, I spray my face every day at least five times. Meron ako sa aking study room, sa aking um, bathroom, sa aking night, uh, nightstand. So, when I remember it, I spray my face. And then, of course, moisturizer. Huwag kayong bibili ng pinakamahal. Whatever you're using now, use that. And use that often, morning and evening. Yun lang. And then, of course, the most important is that you are at peace. Ibig sabihin, huwag kayong kukuha ng, ano ito, yung sakit ng doob. All right? You, learn to forgive. Learn to forgive. At saka, yung sinasabi mong uh, people want to put us down, eh, ba't baka makikinig? Bakit kayo makikinig sa mga negative sa inyo? Alam niyo kung sino ka. Alam niyo na tayo anak ng Diyos. We are adopted children of God. So kung ano man ang sabihin ng mga ibang tao, inggit lang yan. Don't listen. Lagi, be, be, we be with people who are positive. And of course, siyempre, walk with God. Right? Lakad ka. You know, ano ba yung uh, Proverbs? Proverbs 3, verse 5 and 6. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Do not depend on your own understanding. Seek His will in all you do, and He will show you which path to take. Oh, yun lang. So I sleep uh-huh. light. And ako, I mean, you know, oras na pagod, tulog, tulog straight. Of course, you know, you have to go to you know the bathroom. Yes. Pero balik ko na tulog gule ako. So I sleep well. Yun lang. No, it's not yun lang. You have to be intentional. Kailangan talagang sasabihin mo, I want to live a good, useful, and serviceful life. You know, be the best person, be the best version of yourself. So isipin mo, anong gusto mo as, um, as a person? So, you know, that's what you follow. Be, be the best person. Be the best version of yourself. Yun lang. Yes. Yes. No, yes, just sabi mo. because oh. kayo, tingnan mo, nobody will guess your age. Age, minus 20. Whatever you are, minus 20. Yes, yes, yes. I'm gonna But, de- oh, oh. ako kasi I, I try to be really delusional. I'm forever 28. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> forever 28 siya. Oh, Oo. Oh. I think I have the Peter Pan syndrome or whatever that is. Yes, <laughs> yes. Yes. Never go- <laughs> Never Pero Miss Lloyd, ang gusto ko yung sinasabi nyo kasi lagi ko yan, kahit sa Facebook, pinapost ko lagi yan, lagi ako nagtagsusulat minsan, na always be a better version of yourself. And there's if there's if there's anyone who can push you, um, it's just you. You always think about like, be a better version of yourself. Don't even try to emulate other people, yeah. other people's success. Kasi doon magsastart yung ingit, doon magsastart yung negativity, doon magsastart yung parang, you always compare yourself to others because they're they're not you're not successful as they are then Lalo you, you feel like you're a failure media, it, it, it amplifies it exactly yung exactly pag- social media if you're looking at the negative you will be negative you will be depressed yes akin alam mo arithmetic one plus one equals two ibig sabihin plus all right plus equals plus ngayon one minus one equals zero so, minus wow. equals minus. So, bakit ka pupunta sa mga negativity, sa mga negative people, yes. sa mga nag sa mga nag-laging galit, sa mga laging mm-hmm. uh, very, ano yung tawag um, critical, laging critical. Why will you stay with people like that? Uh, so, sure. Facebook, bakit ka hahanap yung mga nagmumura sa'yo? Yung mga, why? Why do you want to disturb your peace of mind? True, Is that, true, true. that common sense? Huh? Jesse, Jacob. Mm-hmm. Totoo, totoo yan. No sense yun? Totoo. Yeah, that's true. Pero, Miss Lloyd, yung ano mo na mention mo, ah, curious ako, before we discuss about like, oh my God, maraming salamat. Ay, 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 Sobra. Pero Miss Lloyd, ha, before we discuss about your book, no, kasi excited kaming may himayin yung libro, na, yung libro mo. Miss Lloyd, ha, ano, how do you deal with, I mean, lahat naman tayo may bashers, no? I mean, especially you kasi, my God, I mean, lahat, lahat ng kahit nga presidente ng, ng Amerika, kahit na maraming yung mga good deeds na naginawa, even ang si God, di ba? Meron pa rin siyang bashers. So, how do you deal with it? 
you know, every morning I I, I take time for reflection or ang tawag dun meditation. Ako sa akin is called Zen practice. I kneel oh, wow. and in front of a crucifix with the gong. All right. I just count my breath in, breathe in, breathe out. Because I know before God, God loves me. So, bakit ako makikinig sa mga, I, you know, I know who I am. I know my faults. Mm-hmm. So, if somebody says this, somebody says that, alam ko it's false, bakit ko papatulan? Bakit mo papatulan? Hindi mo ba alam ang sarili mo? Okay? Sure. So, if it is something that tama naman, so, you know, makikinig ako. Pero alam ko, hindi ako yun. Yung mga sinasabi na, hindi ako yun. So bakit ka makikinig kung sasabi ng mga iba na hindi ang tunay mong personalidad? So, you know, you, you know Jesse, J. Cass, kahit na anong sabihin ng ibang tao, you know who you are. Yes. So bakit ka makikinig sa mga negativity? I mean, it doesn't make sense. Sa akin, that's stupid. Yes. Stupid. That's so true. Practice ano, dead matology. Diba? Yes, dead matology. Dead matology. <laughs> oh, dead ma. Wag pansinin. Practice dead ma. Oo. <laughs> Totoo, dead matology. Gagawa ni Jay Cass yun. <laughs> yeah, para sa akin, tayo, like, we are we, know, we are people of God. So yun lang ang isipin nyo. God loves us. Yes, we are sinners. We make mistakes. We are not perfect. But all in the end, God loves us. So ano pong sasabihin natin? Diba? Grabe no. Kaya pero Miss Lorda, so ngayon balik tayo ad, ano tayo sa libro mo. So nung nung when you were when kasi I wanted to know how how you decided what made you decided to to know to, to write a book, right? So yeah, pero you I Not know ga, picture, yes. Ga, the new Miss Lorda. No, so wait, nung time pa yun Miss Lorda, did you ever had a doubt um within yourself na parang oh uh, sige na nga wag na nga or, or nagkaroon ka ba ng mga ganung question in your mind? No, never. <laughs> never. Why? Because when we were growing up, I was the first daughter, the first girl. Papa had two boys ahead of me. At alam mo ang papa ko, because he was a successful businessman, he was so strict to my two boys, to my two older brothers. Naku, Diyos ko, pag nagka, nagkamali lang ng konti, naku, panay ang mura. But I am the first girl. Ay, naku, for my father, I can do no wrong. I can do whatever I want. Para bang laging ang expectation niya sa akin, kung ano man ang gusto kong gawin, mangyayari. So, I was class wow. valedictorian in high school, cum laude in St. Teresa's, and I was um, number seven lang ako in our graduating class sa College of Law. Ang gagaling kasi ng College of Law eh. But sa aking isip, kung yan ang gusto ko, then I work hard. I work very hard. Lalo na nung, kaya nga nung, you know, when I married Mr. Lewis and the uh, U.S. Supreme Court said, you don't need to be an American citizen to take the bar. Apply agad ako. So, yes. I man na, I have to pass the bar the first time. Ayoko ng second time pa to fail. So, anong ginawa ko? In the exile ko ang aking anak, si Leslie. She was mm-hmm. 13 years old. I called my mom, my mother-in-law. I never call her mother-in-law, Caroline Fugit. Mom, can you take Leslie while I'm taking studying for the bar? So, wala akong, I mean, you know, so I sent her para walang distraction. Yes. And I told Mr. Lewis, Ma, I mean, darling, is it all right? I will not cook. I will not do the laundry. I will not, I will not go shopping. I yes. just want to study 15 hours a day. Ganon. You work hard, but you know that's where you're going. Then work hard and you will get there. Ngayon, sasabihin ng iba, Eh, baka mamaya I fail. Eh, do you fail? Do you go again? Ibig sabihin, you know, if failure comes, failure comes. But tomorrow is another day. The sun will come up tomorrow. Okay? So you go again. Maybe you do it differently. But don't be discouraged. Whatever. Pareho ninyo. Tingnan nyo. Jesse. <laughs> tingnan mo. Every Thursday, uh, you know, once a week, nariyan kayo over a glass of soup. Masaya kahit na anong nangyayari sa buhay nyo. Masaya kayo. Oh, see, naka na third year na kayo. I know. Ay, nako, Miss yes. Loida, uh, Before... the first the first two years at Delk Jesse to eh, the tenacity of Jesse. We were hitting three to four times sometimes uh, five a, times a week. A week. We wow. hit the, we hit while the iron was hot during the pandemic. The pandemic. Ah. So kasi during that time Miss Loida, we were um so every time let's say for example since wala ngang trabaho yung ibang mga celebrities no so whenever they have like a, a show online or they want to promote so whenever they, they reach out to me 
So ako, I would, parang, parang ano na rin eh, parang public service na rin namin yun. Actually, it's a parang, it, it was really a public service uh, during that time. Even until now, kasi oh, I couldn't say no because I believe that during that time, it was it was our only way to help. You know, for for the for for, for those um artists that who's struggling during that time, na kailangan nilang komita di ba sa online. So we were here to help promote, and marami producers na nakapansin. Some of those those artists are like upcoming artists or or artists na they don't have a job for for quite some time, and then nagsa start sila magkaroon ng mga so mga muse a uh, new album or new EP nila. So I feel like you know what we're we're just here we're just you know God just utilize us as an instrument you know to help so nagcaga kami tama kami Lloyd nagcaga lang talaga kami kahit pagod na pagod na kami minsan uh, pero we're having fun isa sa magandang uh, result is nakilala ka namin more than a year ago Miss Lloyd Yes Miss Lloyd na nak- nakilala ka namin di ba Nagyas ka sa amin <laughs> Nagyas ka sa Grabe no yes. yes I'm honored I was honored then that you, yes. you know, that you invited me to your yes. uh, Albrecht glass or uh, Oh my God. Yeah. I, it's an honor. And no, I'm Ms. curious, Miss Loida, kasi, and dito na yung book mo, diba? Ay, mama. grab! Oh, oh my God. The oh, epitome the of working woman. 50. Well, billion dollar gamble. Wait, Miss Loida, talk about us, about this, ano nga, this, this magazine. Kailan to? Uh, that was when I took over the company in 19, well, this is 1996, but I took over the company in 1994. 1996. Oh because Mr. Lewis died 1993, January. Okay? So the whole year, uh, his brother, my brother-in-law, his uh, younger brother took over. Kasi alam niya, baka may mangyari sa kanya. So ginawa niyang vice chairman. So when, alam mo, talaga na, it was so, so hard dahil sa um, biopsy that he had brain cancer was Christmas, December 31. Tapos namatay ka, January 19. That's only three weeks. Oh na para akong binuntal. Na talaga, oh na wala na iwa. So, I am so grateful to Jesse, Jess, to, sorry. I am so grateful to Gene Fugit because he took over while I was nur- nursing my pain and my sorrow. And he was also, they were very close. So, but after six months, nakikita ko medyo delikado yung company. Ng, ng asawa ko, the, the company that he bought, Beatrice International. Yes, yes, yes. So sabi ko, uh, Jean, we have to find a new CEO. Alam mo, nag, ano kami? Nag, uh, we, we, um, we paid Spencer Stewart, a lot of Spencer Stewart, a lot of money to send us CEOs na mga, you know, mga batikang CEO. Si, batikang CEO, yeah. Yes. So we interviewed five people. Pero lahat sila, okay lang. Mga, hindi, hindi sila African-American, okay lang yun. Uh, humihingi ng malaking malaking pera okay din lang yun Albino mo si Jesus he will be CEO of a billion dollar company mm-hmm. pero pag tinanong ko oh will you be able to make it successful we'll try our best sa isip ko try your best if, it, if you fail oh, paano na <laughs> paano na <laughs> yeah. Yeah. if you fail Nandi, ang turo ko oh, why, why, why did you fail so sabi ko mabuti pa I'll take over so that if it fails kasalanan ko you know wow. Take over responsibility over your own res- over your own fortune over your own life. Or yun ang ginawa nyo. Tingnan mo, Jesse, hindi ba? All right. Yes. Just, I want to be over a glass of two um, uh, uh, Facebook or on Instagram or kung ano. So you just did it. Yes. Kahit na yeah. pa sponsor, wala pa kayong ganito ganyan. You just did it. So sabi ko sa akin, sarili, I will just take over because it is my husband's company. If it fails dahil sa doon, para ba three, three fingers are pointing to me. Ano mo? Turo ka to. Oo nga, no. Oo, yeah, you're right. Yes. Now, anong ginagawa mo? O, sabi ko, that's why. That's why I took over. One year after Mr. Lewis died. Grabe. Ano no? nga? Hindi kayo, yung, Nak- una, yung first year niya ba ng uh, pag-takeover, uh, hindi kayo nahirapan, Miss Loida? How old were you then? Huh? Uh, How old were you during that time, Miss Loida? Number. And at that time, it was unlisted. <laughs> ah! Grabe yun! Ang ganda ni Miss Lloyd. Ang batang ba? Maganda pa rin naman until now. Pero, so, no, but that's more than 15 years ago. May kaya pala na in love si ano. Ang ganda nga nung sa libro mo. Kinukwento mo kung paano na in love si Miss Lloyd. Ako, teka, pag-ihibay-ihibay. Pero Miss Lloyd, so paano, nahirapan ba kayo nung nag-takeover? Nung uh, question ni J. Cass? Hindi. 
Ang ibig kong sabihin, when I decided to take over, so it's a role, all right? I will be CEO of this billion dollar company, a Karamihan White Men Managers. So I have to take the part. Unang-una, I thank uh, Butch Miley, dahil sa, sabi niya, okay, Loida, we'll have to lower your Filipino accent. Ibig sabihin, he hired a speech instructor because as a Filipino, you know, sometimes you say that instead of that. Yes. Uh, then, instead of then, and then the, the boy, the, 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 the boy, instead of the boy. You know, so, you uh, know, yeah. clear. of course, I still speak with a Filipino accent, but it's not as pronounced. Yeah. Tapos, he hired also uh, um, how to how to deliver a speech because I will be giving speeches. I will be the chairman of a company before the shareholders. So, anong ginawa niya? He hired also public speaking. Okay. So, kinunan ako ng television so that every time I say a sentence, she will critique me. So, you, you know, you have to whatever it is that you want to do you prepare for it yes so, so that you're not you know, para kang hindi ka tanga <laughs> exactly totoo yan totoo yan mr lewis always say you represent me and you know when we were in paris he bought me what tour i mean clothes that he likes me to wear of course i i will have to wear it first and kung gusto ko sige bibili niya so i took um i took note of the kind of style that he wants and so I adapted it. Ibig sabihin, for all of those of you who are aiming to go somewhere, then see, when I got, if I'm going to get there, then I have to look the part. All right? Sure. That's Yun, true. Yung, yung mga ganon. Okay, so if you say, na nervous ka ba? When you prepare yourself, when you are right there, and you really try your best, wala nang nervous. Or even if you are nervous, you can still do well. Yes, yun mga ganon. Diba? Galing, no? Oo. Na, ano talaga ako, na, inspir- na, very inspiring talaga yung mga examples mo, Miss Loida, no? Mm-hmm. I mean, ako din, it reminds me of myself, Miss Loida. Ka- pagkaparehas kati tayo ng, ano, no, ng birthday, I'm 25 and you're... December tut- 23. 20, uh, 23 ka ako, 25. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mga type I mean, A, person, mga, type mga, A. mga go-getters. <laughs> Ganun din, Miss Loida. Alam mo, <laughs> kwento ko lang, Miss Loida, ako naman nun, I started as, when I came here, as a receptionist, eh, sa construction um company tapos I like, ano naman kung may ano ako if i have a a bachelor's degree or whatever and then slowly i just i'm like you know what i'm not going to be a receptionist or an admin all my life i work so hard now i'm a director in mta so i really work hard and you were right when you said that you have to play the part kailangan hindi uh, hindi ka mukhang tanga so whenever like I see like whenever they have like a meeting or or whatnot, so I have to make sure that I adapt, I listen, and then gusto ko yung suot ko rin, power suit. Katulad nila kahit admin lang ako nun. Cause I want to make sure that you know I know someday that I'm gonna be there. So slowly, so ganon. Tawag yeah. Jake, kas to so, open pareho kami ni Miss Lloyd. Oh, 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 yeah. well, well, while I was reading the book, Miss Lloyd, ah, yes, oh, isip ko si Jesse sabi ko, I, I know someone like this. Tama, di ba, Jesse? Yes. Hindi ka lamang, hindi ka lang receptionist. You are an executive and you acted as an executive. Yes. Yes. Not that you are proud or anything like that. You are yourself. And they yes. saw that in you. Alam mo, whatever you are, makikita mo ng tao. Pareho mo. You know, you know more or less people. You know, you, you may, meron kang sense. So yes. as you develop yourself, people will see your value. People yes. will see that you have principles. Okay? Yes. And that mm-hmm. you are ambitious. All right. Yes. So, yeah, I saw that. I know, Miss Loita, in, in part of the book where you, where you're working as a secretary for the law firm. For the law firm, and, no. Then, uh, you don't, you don't, you, um, you haven't taken the bar, uh, bar, the yet, bar so exam. Yes. You can tell ng more secretary ka, pero you you weren't worried because you know you you said in the book you were be, you were being given actually mga trabaho na pang lawyer na kasi they saw how you are. Yes, oh, parehas tayo ganun din. <laughs> Galing, no? Yes. Yeah, hindi lang yun. Every year, I would go to my boss, I deserve a raise. Why? Because look, every case na hinadal ko, sinusulat ko for one whole year. Look, this is the case I've handled. Ayo, I deserve a raise. You have to, st- dito sa Amerika, sa Pilipinas, hindi pwede. But dito, you know your worth, you have to fight for it in a yes. nice way. Every year, boss, uh, Mr. Yeah, 
uh, look, this is only case that I deserve a raise. So you have to negotiate for your own standing. <laughs> so by the time I left on the third year, I was receiving the salary of a lawyer, even if I'm not admitted. Galing. Diba? Grabe, no? Pero, Miss Loida, parang, ano, siguro past life, ano, magkapatid tayo or ano ba? Kasi ganyan no, din ako eh. Capricorn. Di, 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 Capricorn. Capricorn. Oh, Capricorn. Yes. Capricorn kayo. Oh, oh. Uh, you know, we go up that mountain and we'll get to the top. Yeah, but at least Miss Lorda, no, when I noticed about you too, even sa book mo, um, kasi nagbabrowse ako kasi nga this, this weekend ko talaga babasahin lahat. Kasi nga sinabi ni Jay, kasi box parang makakaprehas kayo ni Miss Lorda. At least Miss Lorda, while you're growing, um, while you're slowly um, stepping up the ladder, at least wala kang tinapakang ibang tao. Di ba? Sarili no. mo lang tal- You work so hard. Like, you work your ass para lang to reach the top. Yes. Okay. This, okay. So you set the goal. Secondly, You have the code of ethics. Okay? Don't do to others what you don't want others to do to you. Yeah. Or positively, do to them what you want them to do to you. So when I was working at the immigration, immigration, yes. uh, when I gave birth, there was um, a 19, okay, 1974, I passed the bar. Okay? 1975, no, 1974, I passed the bar. So where did I want to go? Immigration and Naturalization Service, bakit? Because I had a problem when Mr. Lewis and I got married and they were coming into the United States in, in Hawaii. I had a tourist visa. And then when the immigration officer asked me, so how long will you stay? Permanently, I just got married. Siyempre, totoo yun eh. My God, and I have a tourist visa, false testimony in front of the consulate. Nako, I was I was set apart. But you God. didn't you didn't know Miss Lloyd that it was a you have a no, tourist visa no. No, I know. I, I wasn't an immigration lawyer, you know. Uh-huh. I was telling the truth. So sa isip ko, every Filipino who comes to America will have an immigration problem. So sabi ko, as soon as I pass the bar, I will be an immigration officer sa loob para nakikita ko kung anong ginagawa. Aba, hindi ako kinuha first year. Apply and, and, and I sued them for discrimination. It oh my so- god. Yes, I sued. Bakit? Bakit? You know, alam ko, magaling ako. Lahat ng kapareho ko will be Harvard going to big law firms. Okay. Sa akin, you know, ang kalaban ko, you know, from other New York na hindi Ivy League. So sabi ko, the only way for me to find out that the 12 candidates who were chosen over me are deserving if I file for discrimination. Sige. Discrimination. It took three years. On the third year, nakuha na ng administrative judge yung kaso ko. So I just said, okay, let us compare. Okay, FS-171, yun ang application. There are 12, just compare it. Let them submit their qualifications. And then let, we'll see kung talagang I, you know, I was worse than any of the 12. Aside from passing the bar without studying the United States, I spoke three languages. Of course, Filipino. English and Spanish. Alam mo naman sa si Pilipinas, we can speak Spanish. Yes, speak Spanish, yes. Aba, anong sabi ng judge? All right, produce the 11 the 12, 12 kasi. Eh. Produce the 12 FS171. First year, first month, second month. Six months hindi pinu-produce. Alam mo in law, there is a principle. If you are asked to produce a document or an evidence and you do not produce it, it is assumed that it is contrary to your case. O oh, anong sabi ng judge? Nagantay ako, I waited for six months, hindi mo produce. Now, let's look at Lloyda Lewis' qualification. Na ba? She is class valedictorian, she is cum laude, she is member of the law review. That means to say, she is better than all the other 12. Discrimination based on her national origin, based on her gender, and based on her race. Lloyda, come in. Three years it took them, they gave me three years back pay. They What? Gave- My God! Yes, yes. I came in in 1990, 1978. Okay, 78 ba? 79. And then they gave me until 1976. 677, 78. Three years back pay. Two mo- three months vacation pay. <laughs> vacation with pay. And ganon. Yun. So anong, anong ibig sabi mo nun? Because it is the United States government. Alam mo naman, pag private entity you will sue baka mahirap baka mamaya ma blackball ma blackball yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. ma blacklist ka pa yeah oh. 
Oo, oh, yeah. But, kung talagang alam mo na you have discriminated against, sue them for discrimination. You know, every, wow. every city, every state, it's a commission on human rights. Yun lang. Oh, ang kaya pala ganun kasi... Miss Lloyd, for example, like sa, sa work ko ngayon, no? since I work for, for, for the government, um, ganun talaga every time na, uh, sa state pala, so every time na merong, merong kaming i-interviewin, so I need, eh, marami akong i-interviewin eh, starting next week onwards. So lahat yun, I have to justify kung bakit hindi pinili ko. Kaya pala, kasi nga, naisip ko, okay, I, I know the reason, pero talagang, kasi pwede silang mag Like, why am I not selected? I know that I'm good. Para may sagot agad pag nag-doubt sila. May sagot sila. agad pag Oo. galing ni Miss Lloyd. Ha? Noong nung time na yun, hindi nila naisip yun. Pero si Miss Lloyd, naisip niya yun. <laughs> wow. 1979. Pasok ka. Oh. Do you think, Miss Lloyd, ha? do you think, um, naniniwala ka ba sa luck? Do you think you have that? Because they said like some people, they have like, you know, the Midas touch. That's, it's already innate well, in Jesse, them. Well, Jesse, you have that aside from oh my God, so I don't know. I mean, I, I know I just work hard. But do you, do you think you have the Midas touch? Ang sabi nila, it's not so much the Midas touch. It's preparation and opportunity coming together. Okay? So that's what you would call luck. So, ito, why did I win? Because alam ka magaling ako. I mean, it's not, and then, you know, and then, yun nga, I have my qualifications you know, becoming valedictorian is not easy. <laughs> becoming cum laude is not easy. Okay, becoming, you know, working hard in law school is not easy. But you work hard. Preparation. Plus mm-hmm. the opportunity comes. Kumisa naman, bulag tayo na hindi natin nakikita may opportunity pala. O kaya, we are so lazy, we do not look at the opportunity. Because there is always opportunity. Pareho mm-hmm. niyo. You know, with, uh, because you have a vision, Jesse, Sabi ko, gusto ko maging, uh, you know, in front of the camera. So you did it. Wala kayong, um, you know, you have not had experience really, although may- maybe you did. Pero you dared it because that was in your vision. Ngayon nga lang, galing kami sa isang art exhibit sa uh, uh, Pier 36. Uh, si Chadwick. Chadwick was a Filipino artist. Alam mo? He was partner or going to partnership at Ernst & Young. That's a very big, very, very... Yes. Oh my God, Ernst & Young, yes. Something firm. Oh, magaling na magaling siya. So when he was ready for partnership, sabi ng partner, okay, we would like to make you partner. Would you, would you be, are you ready? He said, give me another year. That lung beses siya pinuntahan. At, the, at uh, 19, 8, 2017, tinanong uli siya, partner na siya. So on the one hand, Wow, that is middle class, upper middle class when you become a partner of a big accounting firm. Yes. But on the other hand, nasa puso niya, gusto niyang magpinta. He's an artist. So sabi niya, if I don't do it, I become a partner, we will be comfortable, but we'll, I will regret it the rest of my life. So, buti naman, ito ang sinasabi ko sa mag-asawa, kailan kayo may partnership? So sinabi niya sa misis niya, I want to quit. This very comfortable job na meron akong, you know, meron akong cheque every 15 days to become an artist. And that's what he did. Yes, that's what he did. And I asked him, are you happy? Very happy. It's because I have my wife. The wife was very, exec- was an executive, was earning money, but she agreed. Sige, darling, do what you want. Do, is, do what your passion is. And now, there he was. Ang ganda ng kanyang mga painting. Sabi niya, this is the touch of spring. It's abstract. Pero makikita mo, when you see it, it's so joyful. It's so happy. Because he followed his, his heart. heart. His, his, dream. Yes. his dream. His yes, dream. Tsaka, ano, Miss Lloyd also, uh, ang, ang galing mo sinabi mo. Kasi for example, like, di ba, may, uh, may advertising agency din ko, may gigil. We have no clue about ad agency, although I took up communication arts. But, I, after that, as soon as I arrived in the U.S., ano na ako, nag-construction industry na ako. But when my cousin offered it to me, si Bert, so I was like, you know what? It's really my passion. To, I was just not given a chance in the U.S. So why not? Parang pikit yung lang yung mata mo and then just go, go do it. Like, ang galing nung sinabi mo, Mr. So ta- you think tama yung ginawa namin that we just jump on that opportunity and then we'll just learn from it as we go along? 
Correct. Yeah. Kaya natin. Kaya natin. You know, if you cannot be 100% perfect, 75% is okay because you will learn as you go along. At saka matalino tayo, magaling tayo. We're very resourceful. Mga mm -hmm. Filipino, very resourceful. All right. Now, what I want to impress, lalo na dun sa those who will buy my book, Yes. Oh, yeah, balik tayo. Yeah, advertise natin ang well, Advertising tayo. Yes, yes, yes. We were not, we, when we got married, we ha, we were living in a five-story walk-up walang elevator. One bedroom. Pagod no. ah, pagod. Pagod, pagod na pagod. Okay. <laughs> no, I, have to, I have to stop on the third floor. <laughs> dahil sa, you know, lalo na may dalang mga supermarket or whatever it is. Yes. Okay. Groceries, ang dami nun. Oo. Oh, oh. So, ang ibig kong sabihin, you know, we, we, we went up slowly. And then, my husband was a practicing lawyer. Alam ko, he's the one going up. So, I, 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 I did it, you know, I was working. So, akong bahala sa uh, expenses to buy the groceries and things like that. At alam nyo, yung sa umpisa lang, lalo na when my husband quit the big law firm and started on his own. So, syempre, you know, walang income muna. So, sulat ako ng cheque to buy pork chops. Mrs. Lewis, sabi ng butcher, your, your check bounce. <laughs> so, ako, yeah, give it to please. I'll give you cash when my, when my paycheck comes. Mamaya, ito na naman, grocery. Mrs. Lewis, your check bounce. Not sufficient funds. So, during those first years that Mr. Lewis was on, ang aking sufficient fund is around one inch thick. So, huwag sasabihin ng ibang tao, ay, naku, mayaman na sila. We did slowly. All right? We did it slowly. Slowly but surely because Mr. Lewis was very, very certain he wants to be top in corporate America. Actually, when he was seven years old, sabi ng tiya niya, sabi niya, I want to be the richest black man in America. I never knew that. I yeah. never knew that. But, you know, in his mind, that's where he's going. And so when he was at Harvard, Harvard College of Law, yes. he, his best term paper was merger and acquisition. And the first sentence is, in order to create wealth, you have to buy, you have to do merger and acquisition, meaning you buy company or you merge companies. Yun. So while he was practicing lawyer, asabi niya, we only have 24 hours to build a client. But if you are in business, the sky is the limit. So every time, every time that he wants to buy a business, he failed. Second time, he failed again. Third time, he failed again. Three oh times God. he failed to buy a business. Yep. That's in his book. Oh, yeah, nga, eh. yeah, Please, oh. basahin nyo. Naku, buy the book. Oh, oh. Why should... Hindi, hindi. Yung isa, yung isa. Ah, yung isang book. Okay, why should guys have all the fun? Yes. Why should white guys have all white the fun? White guys have all the fun. Reginald Lewis created a billion-dollar business empire. Ito. And I wanted I wanted it to be published dahil sa maraming, especially black men, they will be able to understand how to dream big. At saka ngayon nga, I know every time I meet somebody, you're Mrs. Lewis, your book, your husband's book inspired me. I was doing this, and when, after I read the book, I did this. Okay, I became an entrepreneur, or I, I aimed for the top in my, in my business. That's why. 30 years, Jesse, Jacob, 30 years I was doing this. All right, 30 years so that people will know it, people will get inspired. After 30 years, I Chapter six lang ako sa dito sa I'm chapter six meeting Lloyd and Nicholas. Sabi ko I better write my book so that hindi lang chapter six I will write about who I was prologue before I met Mr. Lewis. Yes. Twenty four years as the wife of Reginald Lewis and then after that running a billion dollar empire. Oh, oh, yan, yan, yan. How did you oh my God! Oh, magaling kami yung story na pagdating sa ganyan. Yan ba sa ano? Oh is that my in, God! Is that in Manila Hotel? 1969, that's Reginald Lewis. In Manila. We got married in Manila. Manila Hotel, oh. Manila oh, Hotel. My... Saan yung nakuha yun? Ang galing. Oh, God. Miss Lloyd, grabe, no? Kasi a lot of people talaga, they have this notion na yaman na nila. Parang, ay, laking yaman naman yan. Kasi, of course, everybody knows that you, your family, you came from an affluent family. Oo nga. Pero hindi nila alam na slowly talaga kayong umakyat. 
So, pero doing that time, Lloyd, ah, curious ako. So, first, second, and third, na, nag-failed, right? First and second, nag-failed. So, during, what was your reaction during that time? Kasi usually, ang, ang, ang wife, di ba, nagagalit na, stop that! Let's na, just, nanginig na. Nanginig <laughs> na, no? Let's, uh, ayaw na i-support. So, uh, how did you deal with that? I'm talking to all the wives, when your husband is down, lift him up! Huwag mo sasabihin, eh, kasi ikaw, napakaganito, ganito. What? What are you going to do? Your husband, your your helpmate, you know, your significant other is down. Bakit mo tatadyakan pa? Anong klasik yung kaibigan or asawa? So, sure. whenever he's feeling down, you know, when when Mr. Lewis is black in America, he would come and would come home and say, you know, I said this to somebody, I wish I could say it. Nasabi na niya. So, anong sasabihin ko? Oh, that was so... Why would you... No. Darling, that was the right thing to say. Nasabi na eh. So bakit mo patatadya ka? That was the right thing to say. You did correct. Don't worry about it. It was right. Yun, that's the eight. Support, affirmative. Love, the language of love. It's not just saying, I love you. You affirm. But that was I, good. I have a question with that, Miss Lloyd, though. Is, is it... E, paano yung hindi ka naniniwala doon sa sinabi niya? Are you still gonna say, it's right? <laughs> Look. If you if you think it's it's wrong, but it already happened and your partner is so down, fake it. Are you on? Fake it, yes. <laughs> fake it till you make para it. Para sa love. Yeah. Oo, para Uh-oh. sa love, yes. Kasi nga, anong mangyayari? Ito na, your partner is so down. You know, malungkot. Dadagdagan mo pa ng lungkot, tapos na, nangyari na. So, fake it. No, darling, it is okay. It's all right. You will do it. You'll do better. So, ganun. All right, because you are a partner, you're a team. Magkasama tayo. His failure is your failure. So bakit mo patatadyakan? That doesn't make sense. And in line with that, Miss Lloyd, darin pala, nabanggit mo dun sa isang chapter is like when, di ba masyadong tedious yung work ni Mr. Lewis, di ba? Mr. Lewis, yeah. And, and uh, talagang and stress na stress out siya. So pagdating niya automatic sa house, sa, sa apartment niyo na maliit, talagang he's, he's already stressed out. And then, uh, mag- hindi maganda yung aura niya and all. Pakisabi nga sa amin, describe what do you do as a wife then? Okay. As, sa aking isip, no? He is out as a black man. He is fighting monsters and dragons of racism, bigotry, discrimination, even physical assault. You know, I told you uh, then that one time when he came home, the black tie, everybody was in tuxedo. He was, this, he was sitting down and here was this old white man who came to him and scry- Guna lang, just come on, my God, napaka-condescending. So, anong ginawa ni Mr. Lewis? Tumindigdig siya at hinipulindig. Oh my God! Yung ulo niya, parang bata. No, 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 Mr. Lewis was sitting down and there is this white old yes. man who were also tuxedo. I mean, everybody was, you know, uh, uh, looking, looking good. And he had the nerve because he was black to put his hand over the head. As condescending ba? Oh, very oh, oh, yes. patronizing. Very patronizing. Mr. Lewis didn't accept that. He stood up and... <laughs> in ano yung... Kinares na niya yung ulo. You're right. So, when you are... When you face that outside, para bang when you come home, nariyan pa sa isip mo yun. So, meron akong sasabihin, naku, eto na. Nasigawan na ako. Ganon. I didn't take it personal. I understood that he is out there. Sino pang bubugahan, bubugahan niya ng ano? E sa akin na lang, mas mabuti pa sa akin. Because it's not wow. just me. He is just reacting to outside forces. Yun, yun ang ibig kong sabihin. Understand your man. Understand your better half or your significant other. Na pag sumasagot, sumisigaw, hindi personal yun. He's just letting out steam. And what better to be at home? Kung sumigaw siya sa labas, baka mamaya mag pa yan. You know? True. So, oh, you know, oh, oh. understand who you are with. And just be patient. Ano ba yun? Love is kind. Love is patient. Love is not self-seeking. Love is not proud. Love is not selfish. Love does not keep a record of wrong. Oh, mga oh. kababainan. Oh, ginawa mo na naman yan. Oh, ah, nakita mo yan. Hindi ba noon? Ay, yung ano, yung mga ibabalik, na ibabalik. Na, ibabalik. Pinukay na naman yung binaulan. Pinukay na naman. 
I'm fault mo ito, number one, number two, number three, naku, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't keep a record of wrong. Erase, erase, erase. Forgive. Oh my. Pero, Miss Lord. Sometimes it's necessary when he is down and you are down, hindi kayo na gano'n. Can we just talk about something that bothers me? Oh, then, then you say it. Oh. Pero, nag-aaway kayo. How, how do you, no. did you, you never no. had fight? You never no. had a fight? Siyempre, nag-fight kami. Pero alam ko, pag ako nagsalita, sasalita din yan. And that's what my, you know, when I was growing up, papa and mama, gana, taltalan, taltalan, taltalan. Ang nakakatawa, ako, you know, as a, as a young te- teenager or, or, you know, as, a, as their ch- daughter, nakikinig ko si mama may sasabihin. Ang dinig ni papa, iba. Si papa may sasabihin. Ang dinig ni mama, iba. Sabi ko, Diyos ko po, Tagalog na yan. <laughs> Hindi magkaintindihan. So, taltalan ang taltalan. So, sa isip ko, if if I'm getting married because I was not I was not planning to get married. If I get married, it will never happen. So pag nagkakagalit kami, sige, salita ng salita. <laughs> Hindi ako nagsasalita. Okay? Oh. Pero sinasagot ko siya sa isip ko. <laughs> sinasagot oh my God! Sa isip ko. Oo. Tapos dahil sa hindi ako nagsasalita, eto, tutuno na lang ang luha ko. Dahil sa hindi ko siya masagot. Jessie, kaya mo ba yun? Hindi. <laughs> Parang hindi kaya ni, hindi kaya ni Jessie <laughs> yun. Hindi, hindi. Pero oras na, oras na tumulo na ang luha ko, panalo na ako. Panalo na ako. He sees that I am I am crying. O, oh, di, kieto na siya. Quiet na siya. And he'll hug you. Ganun na. O okay, kaya, I can hear from his voice, hindi na siya galit. At saka mamaya, meron ng, you know, the next day, meron ng regalo sa akin. Ooh! <laughs> yung mga terms of endearment, oh, mga regalo. <laughs> you know, he will never say, I'm sorry. Pero maalam ko sa kanyang action that he is sorry. Alright. So, uh-huh. yan ang aking mga, huwag kayong sasagot dahil sa hindi naman iintindihan ng inyong better half of your, huwag kayong sasagot. Talaga. Hindi kayo magkakaintindihan, honestly. Pero pag ikaw naman, Miss Lorda, every time, like, let's say, of course, I'm sure there was a time na ikaw naman yung nag, nag-nag, not nag, or po, you know, you're the one who's mad. What does he do? Does he keep quiet? Or he will just, you'll start bickering na? No, no. I just say what, I say it once, and then I never talk again. That, kasi hindi kayo talaga magkakaintindihan. Mm-mm. Hindi kayo magkakaintindihan. Pag galit ka at galit siya, hindi kayo magkakaintindihan. Okay. You will just break each other's heart. heart. Tapos mamaya sasabihin mo, ay naku, ayoko na nga sa kanya. At saka, hindi. Language of love. Five different ways. All right? Service. Words of affirmation. Uh, attention. Sabi ko nga sa inyo, sabi ko sa ano, I listen. I listen to what he was saying. Okay? Try to be doon. Hindi ka nag-iisip ng, ano bang lulutuin ko mamaya? Uh, kaya, Ano yung ano yung gusto tawag? No, you listen. You are there hundred percent. Yan ang sinasabi. By you know that is more or less in our religion. Be attentive. Be be be, be patient. Be kind. Ibig sabihin, makinig ka. Okay? Ginon. Mm. Oo. Hindi lang yung ano kuda ng kuda. Oh, makinig oh, ka oh din. At saka wait, Miss Loida, nabanggit mo yung pagluluto ha. Uh, oh, oh. Ano ba? Masarap um, ka ba magluto? Na, na, nabasa ko yata doon na parang <laughs> na, na, naging, uh, naging master fried chicken fried cook. Fried chicken, eh. yes. Oh, so, pakikwento oh, nga sa amin. Pa, kuinento, paano nangyari naging chicken, uh, chicken uh, madam chicken, uh, naging master kuine, fried chicken ka? Kuinento mo rin yun sa, ano, eh, sa book signing. Oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Kuwento mo sila. Mother, mother has a, a cooks fried chicken very, very well. Sa tinuruan niya ako. So, Pag ako nagpa-fried chicken, wow, this is as good as my ma- mom. Naku, that's high praise to me. <laughs> if she says it's high good. But it's very simple. Para sa kanya, fried chicken, pork chop, steak, hamburger. Apat lang. Isang oh. beses. <laughs> hamburger, hindi yata maganda ang pakaluto ko. Tumawag sa nanay niya. Kasi kinikwent dito sa akin ng nanay niya. Oh my God. My blip, blip, blip. She cannot cook my blip blip hamburger properly. Sabi naman ng mother niya. But Reg, she was not taught how to cook. Oh, you have a point there. Goodbye. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know, so, you know, sinasabi ko, my mom was my ally. He was my ally vis-a-vis, you know, Mr. Lewis. Oh my, pero Ms. Lorita, I mean, I also, um, dun sa book launching mo, you guys mentioned about, um, about yung cursing. 
Yes. Yung nagko-curse. So paano mo hina-handle 'yon? Well, sa umpisa, sa umpisa when we got married, my god, you know, I know my father curses P U T A ganyan ganito. Pero in English mas malakas. Mas you malakas, know? yes. M F M F, you know, F U C K S H I T. Medyo para bang nakakaano sa yes. So isang beses, tinawagan ko na si Ma'am. Ma'am, I can't stand it anymore. You know, parang you know, I'm ready to quit. Sa umpisa, sabi niya, Loida, Loida, yeah, calm down. You know, you know he loves you. But when that happens, go to the bathroom, spit on it, and flush it. You feel me? <laughs> Naloka ako doon. So spit, 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 spit it in the it. toilet. Okay, and... <laughs> spit on it. Kasi ang, ang ibig sabihin noon, para bang gusto mong, you know, you, when you're very angry, it has to come out a little bit. All right. So, yun ang sabi niyang sa akin. And it works. <laughs> it works. But after a while, I understood. Kasi umpisa pa lang eh. So, umpisa yun nga. Ang hirap-hirap. Inaangkin ko yung kanyang mga mura. So, by doing that, it's sort of like, it's not yours. Spit it it. Kung hindi mo matake, spit on the toilet and flush it. You'll feel better. Ayun, o nga, flush it pala. Para... Flush oh, it. Iba flush nga. Yeah, flush Uh-oh. it. Yeah. Para Uh-oh. makalimutan. Oo. Ganon. <gasps> Grabe, Miss Lloyd. Nakakaalam mo, guys, please b- buy this book. Kasi, uh, Miss Lloyd, ba, ba, um, I will also buy the other, um, we will buy the other book. Uh-oh. Why should... It is a companion piece, okay? Why should white guys have all the fun by Reg- how Reginald Lewis created a billion dollar business empire? All right? Nariyan yan. Marami kayong matutunan dyan. At ngayon, sa akin, sabi ko, well, ako naman, why should guys have all the fun? Exactly. <laughs> guys have all the fun. An Asian American story of love, marriage, motherhood. Nakalimutan mo motherhood. It's a motherhood. Oo nga pala, motherhood. Pero Miss Lloyd, what about pagiging ano? Pagiging um, uh, nanay sa mga anak. What about si Mr. Uh, si Mr. Uh, Reg? Is, kum- kumusta siya as pagiging ano? Si Mr. Lewis, kumusta well, siya as pagiging tatay? Well, he was strict, but I was more strict. Oh ba? my God! Because I am the one raising the kids. Wala ang mga bata. I mean, my, my, he's work, out working. So I'm the one taking care of the kids. So, But both of us agreed. No TV, Monday to Thursday. Because that's school work. Walang TV. Wala pa nung iPhone. Walang, ano, walang, uh, no, no, no devices. But sa kanila, TV. No television. And every night before they go to sleep, I read them something. Six months old pa lang sila. I already was reading every day, every day, every day. Until they finally learned how to read. So by the time I come back the same night, tapos na yung libro, nabasa na nila. So, ganon. And then, sabi na, and we agreed, there are just two things that we will insist on. One, they respect elders. They have to respect me. And elders, basta wag kang sasagot. Wag kang sasagot. Because that's very Filipino. That's also very, very African American. Secondly, do your work. Do your work means to say you're a student. Study. You know, mm-hmm. you must. You know, be the best. Well, if you can be the best in you, do your best as a student. Mm-hmm. And we'll take care of everything. We'll take care of vacation, mortgage, food, etc. But do your work. Dalawa lang. So you want your room messy? Problema mo yan. You want to color your hair black? I mean, sorry, to call it green? Okay, you okay, yeah. You want to cut your hair short, long? Accidents of ano yan. But do your work, study. So that's how we raised oh. Leslie and Christina. And both of them went to Harvard and graduated cum laude. Wow. Okay, but parang, parang, that's how you and your sister was actually growing up, eh? Diba? You're... Your your um, talaga, ano tawag doon, you, you were at Saint Teresa's, but you invite SDC. the Saint uh, Saint Benedictine uh, or at Labora mm-hmm. prayer and work. Actually, pala Miss Loida, I'm from Benedictine Abbey in Alabang. Oh yeah. my God. So I'm very I'm very aware of the Ora at Labora. I was uh, 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 ano to grade school and high school. Yeah, pero Miss Loida, di ba ano ka? Um, STC Saint Teresa's College. Saint Teresa's College. Ako na masena. Siena College. So, magka, magka, ano tayo? Magka, yeah. Pero usually, yung nagbabangga, ano? Yeah. Pero may sorry na, curious ako, ha? 
kasi na mention mo about about school, di ba Harvard? You know, like the kids um, graduated from Harvard, including Mr. Mr. Lewis. Question para sa ibang tao din na, kasi um, a lot of um, I spoke to a couple of you, my friends' kids. So some of them, yung parang nalulungkot na parang I wanna I wanna go to Princeton. I wanna go to you know Ivy League school, but it's either they can't afford it or second is walang scholarship. So sa school na lang ng ng you know mga county college, right? And they feel like oh I'm not gonna be successful because you know I didn't graduate from from an Ivy League school. So ang sa akin ako I don't I wanna hear your thoughts. Pero for my thoughts, lagi ko siya is, it doesn't matter kahit sang school ka nag nag um graduate. Kasi for me it's like depende siguro f- uh, sa course. It depends on your course. But for me it's like graduating in a in an Ivy League school, I mean, sa start lang yan eh. It's like a fuel for you to get into to your career. And then eventually, you have to work hard to gain experience. So don't, don't, don't be sad right now that you only graduated from a community college. Just do your best to be the best, you know, like, the best version of you. And then work hard after you graduate. So I want to hear your thoughts. Like, gano ka importante ang, ang, ang school, like where you graduate from? Well, you are correct. I agree with you, Jesse, that yes, it gives you a little leg up, but it's what you do with what you have. And if you know, the president of JP Morgan, the CEO, Jamie Dimon, did not come from Harvard or Yale or Stanford. I don't know where he came from, but it's not an Ivy League school. But he is the chair, he is the chair and CEO of JP Morgan, number three in the entire United States. And if you go and ask who are the CEOs of all the top companies, not all of them are Harvard or Yale or Stanford. A lot of entrepreneurs you know, could, are there, but in the corporate ladder, it's what you do that, is count, that counts. Tama ka, Jesse. Yes, so for all of the mothers, your children did not go to Ivy League schools. No matter, it's what they do with their diploma and they will be yes. successful. If you expect that, you know, children will rise up to your expectation. Kaya, wag mo sasabihin, ikaw naman, you know, yung para mang, binababa mo ang idea ng iyong mga anak. Self-esteem, hindi mo inaakyat. So, just, you know, siyempre bantay. Bantay sa mga anak ninyo. Yes. You know, be, be conscious of where they are, what they're doing, etc. And, expect the best from them and because they will rise up to your expectation. Wow. wow. Ayan na, very well said, guys. Makinig kayo kay Miss Lloyd. At saka ito, Makinig kayo and, kay Miss Lloyd. And, and piggybacking on that uh, note, kasi para nakikita ko kayo, kayong dalawa, Jesse, actually, mga idol and inspiration ko kayo ni Miss Lloyd. Eh. Mga, <laughs> you really guys work hard. So, ako nga, I was talking to someone that I'm dating right now and uh, we, we we love our me time actually. <laughs> Alam ni Jesse yeah. So ngayon pa lang that with this, with this job and et, etong podcast and then other things that we do with our d- d- uh, daily lives. Parang feeling namin ano ba to kulang kulang yung day parang ang dami nating gagawin. But but looking at your uh, reading your book Miss Lloyd, I, you're such a work a workhorse. You're like you have two kids, you're raising two kids, 7 years old and a, and, and, a, and a baby. And then you're also working at the same time and you're also a, a daughter's wife. Can you uh, can you give us uh, like an advice para sa amin na, how do you ha- how do you do that? How do you wear so many hats, guys? Okay, I have to admit that when I was doing all of that, aside from that, I was also a real estate magnet. No, we are crazy. My my uh, Best friend in college, BBF, best friend forever. Dr. Angie Cruz and I and my mother bought a building with 32 tenants, a rental building, while I have a work okay, with immigration, with children, baby, one is a baby, and, 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 and one is in elementary school, and I have a hard-charging husband. You know, and doing real estate, I got tuberculosis. I got sick. I got sick because oh, I was wow. doing so many things. So Jacas, that what taught me is that you can have it all, but not all at the same time. You have to choose, prioritize, alin muna. 
Otherwise, your body will give up. So mm-hmm. that's True. that I'm also said in the book. You can have it all, but not at the same time. So True. that's my advice to women who are also like me, hard charging. You have to select. Ano bang gusto nyo? Mm-hmm. You know, husband, a palikero, because you're not home, because you are, you know, doing doing your career. You have children. Na hindi mo ma, ah, hindi mo, you are not able to attend to them. Dahil sa naroon ka, nabas mm-hmm. na karir, and your husband is not cooperating, you know, you have to you have to talk together because you are a team. You're playing in the life, in the in the play of life. Okay? True. You're a yes. sport of life. Nausap kayo. Ano ba? Sino bang gagawa? O, o kaya, you know, just, um, or, or ako naman, in my mind, I made a decision. I will give him 110%. Darling, I'd give you 110%. But if that's not good enough for you, you are free to walk out the door. I will take care of myself. Why? Because his mother left his father when he was five years old. So trauma sa kanya na yung wife oh. will also walk out the door. So I have to assure him, I will never leave you. I will give you as much as I can, 110%. Pero if this is good enough and you found somebody else, Go! Go! I can take care of yeah. myself. In fact, you know, when we were talking, and when he was sick, he said, Oida, you were so smart. You didn't tie me around yourself. You left me, said, I can go. And because you told me I can go, I stayed. Yon. Oh, diba? oh sweet. <laughs> Talaga, ano, tsaka Miss Lloyd, ano, um, I think, manage, kasi parehas tayo Miss Lloyd, eh. ano, kuratsya din ako, eh. like, I have, like, I think, like, feeling ko na bo-board ako pag isa lang yung ginagawa ko. Mga babaeng so, walang pahinga. Oo, kasi <laughs> bago sila, parang di ka pa napapagod, ang dami, yung time management talaga. And always, ano, no, Miss Lloyd, um, uh, make sure that you don't forget about 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 yourself as well. You have to love yourself oh, yung as well. Yung health nga daw. Yung health talaga. Importante yan. Oh, you oh. have to make time talaga for yourself din na, you know, like mag, mag manood ng TV or spend time with your family. Yung mga kahit maliliit-liit lang or weekend na date kayo. It, oh, Ay, it, oh, ang cute ang picture. Oh, ang cute. I love this wow. picture. I've seen it. <laughs> I love this picture. Like, di ba yung ano lang spend time with, mag date night. Just, ali, parang, just to keep your sanity intact. Diba? Kasi hindi naman lahat, Miss Lloyd, katulad nating ano eh, no? Na kurat siya, like, okay, here, there, 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 there. Oh my God. Pero Miss Lloyd, question, nung time na ano, na of course growing up, no? Yung mga bata, na, may naramdaman kayong racism? Yung mga bata? Racism? Yung mga bata? Yung mga bata, you know, um, other people see racism. Ako talagang siguro dahil sa we were raised, Papa was poor and he lived with a rich uncle. So Papa was always very, very ano, aware of people's um, need, you know, poverty, ganyan. Papa was very generous. Mama was generous too, but she was more strict. She was more, um, yeah, she was more strict. So nakita ko, I mean, we were growing up, there was never really any description Yung mga ganito, pobre yan. I never heard that. Yung mga ganito, pangit yan. Yung mga ganito. You know, there was never anything like that. So, when we, when I, when I was an adult, I did not, I was not conscious of racism. I mean, I was not conscious na, you know, I, I, I really believe everybody is equal in the eyes of God. So, no matter what the color of skin. So, sa aking mga anak, I don't consider that, you know, I don't see really, talaga, I don't see color. Oh, wow. In fact, when my daughter was on television and dancing in a, you know, somebody commented, oh, that girl, that black girl uh, dances well. Sabi ko, sinong black? Does he mean my daughter? Yeah, para bang, oh, why are you looking at people? Oh. Why are you looking at people na may mga description black, you know, oriental and all that? We are all equal. So, your question, did I experience uh, si racism, hindi ko nga naramdaman. Siguro nararamdaman ng ibang tao na magkasama kami, I am Asian, my husband is black, mm-hmm. but really, it's going over my head. But, that's the one time that I got uh, somebody said, you little chink, chink, gulat ako, ha? I mean, you know, to identify me as just a chink, it was like, I was, I was really, I, I, I was really, uh, what do you call this now? 
I was shocked. Mm -hmm. I was shocked that this white woman cannot see me as a human being, but just see me as a chink. Okay, yun. That's the only time. Ang sabi daw niya, oh. kasi nag-cut ka daw sa line. Hindi ka pa talaga nag-cut sa line, Miss uh, Miss Roida. <laughs> Yung totoo. I did, I don't know. But just because I did something wrong, to identify me, to put me down. Okay, mm -hmm. to put you down. That, that is what racism is. Yeah. You are below me. You are not equal to me. You are not a human being. That is what racism is. And it's so, uh, it's not Christian. It's not Christian. Yeah, true, true, true. Oo nga, chink, no? Tinatawag nga tayo mga Asian minsan na, chink, chink, chink. Ako buti, ano, sa uh, experience ko dito sa States, wala pa ako na, ano, na, naramdaman kahit na, na, na there was racism uh, towards me. You know, siguro baka hindi nila ma-identify ko ano ako. Number one, tao ba ako? Kasi <laughs> minsan tinatanong ko rin yung sarili kong ganun eh. <laughs> Alaman ba? O ano ba ba ka? Oo, ano ba? Ano ba? Uh, am I ina an inanimate object or whatever? Oh. ba? Diba? Ah, ito pala. Balik tayo ulit. Ito ang gusto ko. Kaya alam mo, one part of the, the book, Miss Lloyd, is yung kilig na kilig ako kasi doon yung, alam mo title, Jesse, Meet Cute. <laughs> Meet Cute? Okay, while I was, ako, basa, honestly, while I was reading that chapter, Miss Lloyd, because I I love New York. I I'm here now for how many years, but I still feel like uh, I so appreciate it. I feel like uh, yung ano, yung parang bago lang, bagong dating lang ako every day. Hindi ako nagsasawa. I always like if I discover something new, I I'm so excited and giddy over it. Exactly. So while reading your book when you're new here in 1970s Manhattan, I was like a line when you were. Uh, dating um, um, Mr. Lewis, and at the same time, Jesse, they were also traipsing the streets of Manhattan and enjoying New York for what it is oh. offering. I was kind of par par uh, paralleling my own life. Na alam ko single ako, but also like traipsing New York th this year, uh, uh, at this age, sabi ko, oh my God. Na-visualize ko si Miss Lloyd na parang during 1970s, siya na yung original carry of sex in the city. Oh, yes. <laughs> Qu Kwento mo to us a little bit. How was your... Yung panahon na yun, how did you enjoy, enjoy, enjoy the New city, York City in yeah. the 1970s with Mr. Lewis? Gallivanting New York City. Yes, yes. You know, it was all experience for me because, you know, when I, I met him, we were, you know, we were both lawyers, so non-stop talking. And hindi ko alam na the second time he invited me that when you go to his apartment, iba nang ibig sabihin nun. Ayaw daw ni Lord yun, ha? Oo, oh, oh, ayaw ni Lord yun. Okay. <laughs> Madre, di ba? You know? So, my God, nung, nung uh, you know, he started becoming intimate, nasagot naman ako, mamaya, eto na, kinakarga na ako sa bed niya. <laughs> <laughs> Very carry, di ba? Yes! Tapos, Miss Lloyd, ha? <laughs> no, 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 no. So, siyempre, no. Siyempre. You oh. know, you miss lahat. Dalagang Pilipina. No, naman siya. He, he, no, because he's a gentleman. Yo, he stopped. He stopped. Pero, ako, just ko, ang galit, ang galit ako dahil sa, ano ito? Wow, dito pala yung tinatawag na date rape. So, but oh, he's, yes. okay, mm -mm. so, he brought me home, wala akong imik, na, so, kaya nga, sinulatan ko siya. Thank you very much. I had a wonderful time, but I will not have any intimate relations with a man other than my future husband. Goodbye. I I will have fun memories. <laughs> no, goodbye, a god. Goodbye. goodbye, goodbye. Aba, one year, one week later, bumalik sa akin. Tinawagan ako. Sabi to nako, hindi na hindi na kuha yung sulat ko. Okay, labas ulit kami. So we had another nice time. Pagbalik ko na sa hotel, sabi ko, you know, I wrote you a letter. Yes, you did. What? You received it? Yes, I did. I told you don't call me again. Loida, I will not do anything you don't want me to do. Patay. <laughs> tama nga nung umayag ka, di ba? Tama siya, tama siya, tama siya. Magaling si Mr. Lewis oh, eh. Magaling ni Mr. Lewis. Semantics. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh my, don't get, because of that, don't ka na in love. Doon ako na in love in the sense na alam niya kung paano, tama eh. I will not do anything. Oh, do you, so he will not do anything na hindi ko gusto. Okay. <laughs> and he, in, Mr. Lewis was your first boyfriend. First boyfriend, yes. Yun nga sabi ko. I was, you know, I followed my fa my father's dream, a lawyer, pa uh, politics, and I, you know, I, dahil sa gusto niya yun para sa akin, 
he had a movie house named after me, Lloyd yes. Theater. Seven years old pa lang ako. So pag tapos na ako and I'm ready to enter politics, you know, maybe as mayor of Sorsogon and all that, everybody in the town knows Lloyda, Lloyda Nicolas. Yes. Recognition. So siguradong mer- meron na akong chance to win. That's to my win, father. yes, yes. That is my father. So I was not really intending to marry anybody. But little by little, naintindihan ko, this man is more ambitious, more daring, more persistent. Dahil sa alam mo, he entered Harvard without applying. He was in a summer's program and he was so good during that summer program that the uh, teacher, the professor, Professor Sanders said, Reg, if you want to enter the class of 68, you have a seat. Hindi pa siya, na, nag, hindi siya nag-apply. So nakikita ko talagang this man is very, kung anong gusto niya, he will get it. Yun. Oh At saka nga, he, he, he always, I told him not to see me again. Christmas, I was falling in love with him. And sabi ko nga, I, I, we, please, let's not see each other anymore. Because I'm falling in love with you, you may be falling in love with me, but I will break my heart and I will break your heart because I'm going back home. I mean, how mm-hmm. do you know? Ba? How do you know Tamash? <laughs> no. How do I? Parang ganun ba? I, Parang I, inunahan muna. Inunahan muna. It, yes, exactly. Oh. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oo, oh, yeah. So, sige na lang. We continued seeing each other. And then, the third time is when I decided it's time to marry. And so, I, I proposed. Ako nag-propose. Are you oh, going to propose? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Oh, how did you propose? Nasa, nasa subway kami. Walang tao masyado. So tinanong ko lang siya, Darling, do you, have, do you want a big wedding or a small wedding? A small wedding. And where do you want to have it? Um, Saint, uh, at NYU, they have a small chapel. Wow! Ibig sabihin, naiisip na niya. <laughs> he was thinking about it. Yes. He didn't want to tell me. Mama yan, na- naalala niya. Wow, this is the proposal. Oh my God, I have a headache. Yes, Din- mo na lang, no? oh, you just yeah. wrote it out the question out of the blue. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> was he shocked? Was he shocked? No, no, no. He knew that it was a proposal coming from me and he answered. <laughs> oh my God. That's Miss Lori, yes. that's like the guts, oh, no? Pero, pero, the worst is... Oh, nawala. Ayun, the worst is... Na- oh, nawala. Oh. Miss Lori, nawala ka? <laughs> Miss Loida. Miss Ayana, Ayana, Ayana. Ayana, 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 ano, napindot. Okay. Bitin yun. B- yeah, guys, ano yun, commercial breakdown muna. Kaya ganun. <laughs> Para akong nanonood tuloy ng movie habang nagkakwento si Miss Loida. Promise. Pero nawala na naman. Oo, promise. Grabe, guys. Mo, you better buy the book. I mean, you will learn a lot from this book. Uh-oh. I mean, excited na ako to, to read it like on our way to Eagle Rock. Oh, by the way, bam. And Paolo and Sander, we will see you tomorrow. So excited na akong panoorin to on our way to Eagle Hello, Rock. Bam. And especially, hello, Paolo. Yeah. Yan mo. Ako, <laughs> especially <laughs> talaga yun. No? Especially, huwag <laughs> mo naman sabihin, hello, Sander, yung baby. <laughs> Asa na si Miss Lloyd? Pwede si Sander. Teka lang, nandiyan, nag, nandiyan na siya kanina, nawala ulit. Oo nga, Miss Lloyd. What happened? Ayan. Ah. Hi, Miss Lloyd. Teka, anihin ko lang. Hi, Miss Lloyd. Ganun po talaga ang ano... Lloyd, ano ayan. tawag doon? Uh, para siyang ano, cliffhanger. Oh, ay, alam mo, <laughs> grabe no, ang, ang ganda ng life story ni Miss Lloyd. Oh, oh. Parang kahit mabasa ko yung libro, the next time like we'll see kahit her. Kahit na na natin ngayon, you really, I still wanna you really need from, to, from, you need to read it from the start to finish. Kasi, yeah, and, and, and ito, feeling ko rin, kahit na panood, uh, na, nabasa na natin to over and over again, I still wanna hear from her mouth, like, you know, talking about it. Kasi yeah, nakakakiling. Kasi, yeah, and there, there are uh, some stories coming from her that are not in the book. Exactly. Uh-oh. My God. Si, Miss Lorda, nasan ka na? <laughs> oh, get to know her better and show and how she made it. Oh, Paparating pa lang ako dun sa chapter ng ano, eh, sa business eh. I know. Oh. Oh, exciting, no? Miss Lorda, nasan ka na? At ako, so, eh, alam mo, hindi, hindi talaga ako mapagbasa ng book, pero siyempre dahil esteemed guest natin si Miss Lorda. Mm-hmm. Oh my God. At sa totoo lang, pag nagbabasa ko ng libro, I always stop in the middle. Di ba nasabi ah, ko sa iyo yun? Oo, Oo di, nga pala, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pero ang, ang, unang nabasa, ang, ang unang libro na 
na natapos ko was actually yung memoir pa ni Mariah Carey. Yung binigay ko sa iyo. Oo nga po. Oh, hindi wala wala na akong time lalo well, na nag ako yeah, every have, day eh. You have a lot of hats na you're wearing a lot of hats. Ayan. I know. Pero talaga to babasahin ko to this ano. So, Ayan guys. Sorry my computer got low battery so I connect the electricity wheel. Oh, wait a minute. I will use my iPhone. Okay po. Uh, she's Ayan. charging. And while we're waiting. Yes. Ayan guys. So guys ha. Yes. Go Jcast. Do the honor. Teka hindi ko na mabasa. Ang liit. <laughs> Ayan. Loida Louise releases a reviving memoir. A riveting, riveting, sorry. A riveting, riveting memoir. memoir. Oh, said so the co-author of bestseller How to Get a Green Card naman and widow of Reginald F. Louise, first black billion dollar deal maker shares her remarkable journey. New York City, why should guys have all the fun? An Asian American story of love, marriage, motherhood, and a running billion dollar empire. It's the true story of a fire brand immigration lawyer, activist, philanthropist, and accomplished business executive Lloyda Lewis. Alam mo sana no? Sana one of these days, no? Maging kasing successful din tayo ayan. ni Miss Lloyd. Ayan. Ayan. So guys, you can order it in Amazon. Order Amazon and also on, sa Barnes and Noble. Barnes and Noble. Yan. So, uh, naku, pag nasa US kayo, baka makita, makita nyo si Miss Lloyd na matisod nyo. Eh, bi, uh, diba, ikikip ko talaga to dahil merong ano niya, merong, ah, tawag dito, may uh, signature ni Miss Lloyd. Oh, at, saka ng, ko, oh, ni, at saka ni Blair oh, oh, Walker. Yung co-author si Blair. Co-author naman na si Hindi Blair. Hindi po si Blair Witch. Oo, oh, si Blair, oh. <laughs> Blair Witch. <laughs> Grabe no. Tsaka alam mo, um, yung uh, yung mga nakwento ni Miss Lloyd regarding yung she's wearing a lot of ano hats no yung sinabi niya talaga kanina na you have to do it like you pick talaga you pick um oh, oh, let's say if you have that. a five let's say five things to do um you can do it pero pick those two muna to prioritize it kasi it's gonna be hard for you to do it all eh all at the same Otherwise, time yung, yung same intensity same no same intensity oh, oh. ang hirap ang hirap I mean Kaya ako ay ko, ko sa iyo kasi you wear a lot of hats like Miss Lloyd, ah. Yung natama yung sa health, ha? Oo, oh, oo. Oh, oh. oh. Ay, hindi. Trust me, hindi naman ako na, ano? Ay, ano ba ito si Direk? Oh, pati nag-brown out, Jen. Pati nag-brown out ba yun? <laughs> hindi. No, 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 no. Um, yung health, hindi ko pinapabayan din. I mean, I make sure that I sleep. I make sure that I have oh, my, alam, oh, oh. Tsaka, my wine. Tsaka, hindi ako nag-worry ko. Alam ko kumakain ka. Oo. Kumakain. <laughs> no, I don't eat that much, ha? <laughs> Tuma, tumaho so, yung asawa mo. Siya ang kumakain. O, inuman. Hindi, I mean, I eat. Pero, ano, um, yung nga, kailangan gym, may exercise. I, you know what? I, um, I was wondering if, ano, si Miss Lorda, nag, did, may time pa ba nun sa, sa gym mag-exercise? Kasi she Oo. was really, she was really skinny. Until now, actually, she's still skinny. Oo nga. Yung, yung tinanong so, natin siya like more than a year ago. Ano ba sagot niya? Parang tinanong ka siya, what, you're so, you, you seem to be so busy, Miss Lewis. Parang, do you, do you still have time to do whatever? Parang yung sinagot niya sa atin, parang, ano lang, parang, parang related pa yata sa work. Sa naalala Oo ko. nga, eh, parang oh. doon siya nag-exercise. O sige, tanongin oh. natin si Mrs. Lewis. Oh, Tanong oh. natin ngayon kung pagbalik niya, kung nag, uh, nagbago na ba or mas nagbibigay siya ng leeway sa kanyang uh, me time to, ano, for health. Yes. Malay mo, diba? Chalo. Malay mo, nag, magulat tayo, nag-binge pala siya ng Netflix. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, I'm dying hindi, to know. And, hindi ng Netflix mo, at saka ng I want TFC. Oh, yes, oh, diba? Oh. So, papanoorin niya tayo doon. <laughs> hindi siya, alam mo, nakakurious din ako If she dated anyone after, you know, Mr. Luis. Oo, yung ngayon. I mean, you know, like after, di ba? Uh-uh. It's been years. So, kasi di ba yung iba, like after so many years, parang they need someone din naman, a partner in life. That's diba? true. Alam mo, napaisip like, din ako ng ganyan while, yeah. while reading the book na if, uh, if she did, if she did entertain other suitors or were, were there. I know, no. I mean... I, I, ikaw, Jeka, salbawa, meron kang mahal na mahal na mahal na mahal na sobrang mahal talagang daming mahal eh, no? Na significant other. Tapos, that person, sige, fine, maging morbid tayo, passed away. Do you think you, 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 you'll open your heart again to another person? Ano ka ba the next day agad? <laughs> <laughs> I knew <laughs> it. Hindi. I Ako, knew it. I knew it. I knew you would say that. <laughs> I know. I'm sure I'm gonna mourn and Mm-hmm. Medyo naisip ko na rin yung, yung tanong mong yan eh, sa buhay ko na I think it depends on how I love the person and how mm-hmm. how I deal and how I mourn and definitely I'm sure it's gonna be a while you know to mm-hmm. to go over the pain but knowing me I feel like a two days um, is enough <laughs> 
knowing you, two days is enough. Hindi, na, no. Okay, fine, two I'm weeks. So, I'm going to be open. Everything will be open. <laughs> <laughs> na, to open to to new love. Kasi nga, tama ka, you know. Uh, and of course, I'll pray din na sana yung significant other ko will understand. Or, yung parang may mm-hmm. kind of bas-bas. Exactly. Na, I'm sure you will understand, uh, you know, kasi... Now, it's, it's, it's time to move on and to heal. Akala ko kailangan hey, ikaw, mo rin. Ikaw, ibalik ko yung question sa sa'yo. <laughs> Akala ko, di mag- parang bus-bus from him na tipong kailangan ko rin, you know, mag-release ng Pag-tigyan love yung... and affection. Ah, ayan. <laughs> yung mga ganon. May mga pangangailangan. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oo. Ako, uh, naku, lagot. <laughs> ako, 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 kung halimbawa lang, for example, like, um, you know, like, your significant other, my significant other will pass away. Or, hindi, ako na lang, Kung ako yung mawawala, gusto ko, uh, ano, I want him to to date again. To, kasi, ano eh, parang sayang eh. Like, the love and affection that, oh, yan na sabi, papasok na si Miss Lloyd. The lo- parang sayang yung love that you're always, like, me, add me on meet so we can video chat. Use this link. Oh, ito daw, B. Hi. Paano to? Ah, hindi pa mag-work? Yeah, send the link there. Copy the link. Direct ikaw na, hindi ka ka maintindihan. Ano to? Hindi, yung sinasabi ko ulit. Yung technical, inutusan ka ni technical director. Oo nga, ako pa talaga inutusan mo. Oo, hindi sa akin kasi parang, I already, parang, I already knew what type of person you are. The love that you can give, that you gave me for so many years. That I've been, I was so happy and I was so content with your love and I would feel bad for you not to give that love again to someone special. Eh, sabi ni Direk ngayon, hindi, hindi na daw eh. <laughs> hindi, ang sabi ko is, kung ako yon, ako, go. I, I, I'll give you my blessing. I, I, I don't even care, even if it's like two months or three months. For as long as, kasi iba, iba naman tayo ng morning. Di ba, iba sabi nila, you need someone to forget that someone. And I'm a firm believer of that. Nakita ko yan sa friends ko. And sa akin, Nakita ko rin ba sarili ko? Parang, hindi kasi nakakatulong din minsan. No? Yung sinasabi lang, tinatawag lang rebound. Diba, Jika? No, that's Kaya true. Daw, na, may, may rebound. If, if you're giddy and happy about someone new, that would, diba? th- that's a can, great way and tool to forget about if you're trying to forget someone else. Yeah, uh, you know, the, the, ay, and, and yan, ayan, bumalik na si, ano, si Miss Lorda. Ay, sorry, sorry, sorry. No, it's okay, Miss Lorda. Nagkukwentuhan kami din dito. Ay, ayan. Oo. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. God, Diyos ka po. Okay lang, Miss okay Lord. Lang ayan, ako. Ayan, sa bagay. Sige, kahit ano ha, 15 minutes na lang, Miss Lord. Dahil ang dami oh, pa namin tanong eh. Na excited ka. Oo nga, at saka late oh, na oh. rin. Oh. Yes, late na rin, Miss Lord. No, I know, you. Oh. ako mag-i-11. Sorry, pasensya na, Miss Lord. Pero, Miss Lord. No, yes, no, no. I forgot, I forgot to connect my, uh, this one, low bat. Sorry. Ah, okay lang, Miss Lord. Okay lang. Ayan, tuloy ang kwento. Miss Lord, yun ang ano, curious kami ni Jcast. So, while you while you were gone, nagtanong kami sa isa't isa na, So, after Mr. Luis, did you ever date anyone? A new partner in life? No. No, I did not want to date anyone because I know in America, once you date, ang, uh, you know, it will end up in the bedroom. Oh so, para sa akin, I will repeat what Cory Aquino, President Cory Aquino, hindi ba namatay din yung husband niya? Yes. She became president and then she finished sixth term and she never married. You know, para sa akin, when you have been married to a king, how will you settle for a prince or a duke? You know, so yan ang unang-una. Secondly, I have other priorities. My two girls, they were 12 and 19. So I, they have to have my full attention. Natapos ko yung libro. But at the same time, the business, that was his life. I had to make it succeed. So I cannot go, I, I, you know, it's, it's uh, ano matawag ko dito? You know, I know the commitment of man and woman. So if I, if I look for somebody else to be number two, meaning to say the second husband, I know that something has to give up. But at that point, I want the companies to succeed. So, medyo hindi pwede. So, you know, there were there were some, you know, there were so, some na nakakakilig. Meaning, yes. you know, I'm a woman. So, I do feel a certain attraction. But, this time, I use my head. I use my head. Hindi pwede. 
I have other priorities. My daughter, my two girls, how will it be? I will have two girls, they're growing up, I'm mother and father to her, tapos I will have somebody else. They bit divided ang attention ko. So I just made a decision. Right now, it's my two girls, Mr. Lewis, memory, his legacy that I was, you know, kaya nga, that I had to finish the book. And then the business, it took me seven years, but I was able to pay down the debt. Alam mo, as I said, leverage buyout is you borrowed money. Mr. Lewis borrowed one billion. I mean, if we buy the, if we bought the company and borrow one billion dollars at 13% interest, you know, as I told you, you just breathe in, that's 1,000. To breathe out, 2,000. Ang laki-laki ng interest payments mo a month. So he sold half and he bought the company with just half. He borrowed only 500 million. And once he had it, he sold again another piece. So he had only 350 million debt to buy a billion dollar company. And when he died, I paid off zero debt. I paid all of the zero debt. And then I started to sell piece by piece. Supermarket, this ice cream company, the potato chips company, the bottling company in Belgium and in uh, Thailand. And so I got zero debt and I got $1 billion back. Wow. How many, how many <laughs> companies w w was that during that time? Mr. Well, hmm. when Mr. Lewis bought it, it was 64 companies in 31 countries. 31 countries. So oh his, my God. his strategy was not to borrow $1 billion. So even before he bought, even before he got the company, he had a contract of sale. He started selling already. He sold Australia. He sold South America. He sold London. I mean, you know, butterball in London. He sold China. The soup, the um, what do you call it? Noodles company in China. He sold um, Barame, but he concentrated it in Western Europe. That's why we lived in Paris for five years. Uh, don't J. Parle Francais, pakurang mama sufisama. So in five years, I was able to to learn and speak French. Those are our five years. And then on the fifth year, he was stricken with brain cancer and he died. He died. Just ko po para ba kung nawala ng So yeah, took me time to get myself together to see that the company is going bankrupt. And that's when I decided I better take over. That's my story. And read it from my book, from my <laughs> Why Should Guys Have All the Fun. Yes, you would learn a lot of it. Asian American. Yes. Alam mo, kailangan ito. I said, kailangan insisted, Asian American, kasi sinasabi ng mga, mga you know, my, my um, publicist. Oh. Yes, you know, my, my advisors. Why put Asian American? You know, other people would like to read your book. Sabi ka, no, with Asian hate, I want people to know we are like them. We have highs and lows. We have, you know, pain and suffering and joys that we are just like any American who wants yes. the best for our kids, you know, a good job and, and to succeed. That's why I have to place their Asian American story of love, marriage, motherhood, and running a billion dollar empire. Yes. My God. Asian American woman. Yes. Diba? Guys, please no, purchase Mrs. Louis' book because you will learn a lot. Itong kwentuhan namin to. My God, there's, there will be more. You will learn more. That's true. And maybe, maybe from reading this book, you'll be the next billionaire, right? Yes. You, you just, Dream, diba? Dream, Dream big. Right? Dream big. Because yeah. you just, because whenever I read a book, I feel like, um, especially like, you know, um, uh, about the true to life story book i feel like um i'm picking someone's brain and i put it uh, one piece of her brain to this and then i'll, I'll start writing like oh i i think this is kaya mahilig ako magsulat ng mga quotes and everything from from um inspiring people like you my god miss loida pero miss loida my last question ako ah. so from this book is there anything else that you think that you missed that you like wait i should have um, wrote or, or I, I forgot a, a piece or a chapter of, of of my life and I forgot to put it in this book. Meron ganon? 
some parts, you know, especially, um, you know, that's why you need a co-writer. Dahil sa, I won the case against Comelec in the Philippines when we got back our Filipino citizenship. And Comelec said, you cannot vote for president, vice president, because you were once not Filipino. Sabi ko, maling mali ito. Once you become a Filipino, you got back your original citizenship of Philippines. And so there is, you have all the rights of a Filipino. So I went to the Supreme Court and filed the case against them. Et al, ibig sabihin, hindi lang ako, pero sampu kami. And one chapter yun na sinulat ko. Sinulat ko lahat ng pangalan of the people who were with me. Lahat ng 15 uh, names of the Supreme Court justices. Because 15 over zero, panalong panalo kami. Sabi ng aking co-writer, Blair, because he wrote my husband, he finished my husband's book. And he helped me write this book, Loida, Nobody Cares. So, yung aking sentence, yung aking full chapter, four sentences lang that I won the case. So, anong sabi, you know, so maraming mga things like that, that Bear Walker said, nobody's interested, take it out. Pareho nung, oh. uh, pareho nung, when Mr. Lewis died, everyone who spoke, linagay ko sa libro. And so, when I was writing the book that he died, this one said so and so, isang chapter din yun. Sabi niya, Take it out. Oh, yes. Oh, 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 yes, yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh -oh. Miss Loida, as early as now, ba? I know you just released your book. Is there gonna be? Are there bells of memoir number two or uh, a second book? No, siguro ang second book ko is how to look sixty when you're eighty. <laughs> oh, oh and you have every god. right to write that book. Siguro, siguro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Nako, maraming bibili lalo niya, Miss Lorena. <laughs> Kasi yung mga babae, di ba, yun yung mga hilig eh. Parang, di ba, parang mukhang 80, tapos mukha kang, no, Miss Lorena, you look like 50. Are you, what are you talking about, eh, 60? Grabe. <laughs> Thank marami. you, Miss Lorena. Maraming maraming salamat. Thank you very much. Miss, 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 ano, Miss, um, Miss Loida, sana, no, we can have dinner one of these days. Yeah. We hope even a coffee, please. Kasi talagang, ha, we'll ano to, dream come true for us. We'll, have, we'll go to Harvard and I will tell you why Mr. Lewis was the first African-American with a portrait at the Harvard Club. Okay? Oh, wow. Sige, we will set it up. We'll oh, set yeah, it up. can we go yes, and then please. we'll have a cameraman and, we, you know, we, we can talk about, like, you know, like how, uh, uh, oh my God, oh my God, I'm having goosebumps. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Na yung palang na, nakikita ko na. Maraming salamat, Miss Lorda. It's really, really an honor. It's really an honor. Maraming salamat. And before we let you go, Miss Lorda, um, anything that you want to say, a final message to everyone? Well, everyone, especially Filipino abroad, Filipino is living outside. I know the, soft, the hard work and the intentionality while you are away from your family. Or, but because you want to bring them over here to have a better life. What I'm saying is that just be tenacious. First, set your goal always. Ano ba ang goal nyo? Second, obey a code of ethics. Don't make shortcuts. Don't break the law because it will have consequences. And third, determination. Don't give up. Don't give up. Mananalo din kayo. You will get there. So goal setting is G. Obedience is O, determination is D, and you put that together, it spells G-O-D, God. With God, everything is possible. With God, nothing is impossible. Yun lang. Amen. Yes. Para feeling ko may kasalitang angel. Sarap namin. Maraming salamat, Miss Lori. Da, grabe. Always having goosebumps. Salamat. Wow, maraming salamat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and yes. guys, everyone, mga ka-oga, yes. before we end, don't forget, to purchase uh, Miss Why Lloyd's. should guys have all the fun? Yes, new memoir, Why Should Guys Have All the Fun? An Asian American story of love, marriage, motherhood, and running a billion dollar empire. Salamat, yes. Yes. Salamat, Salamat Miss Lloyd. Yes. Thank and you very much to all the DFC and all yes. the others who are going to listen. Salamat. Yes. 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 Thank you, okay. mga ka for uh, 
listening to this very inspirational episode of ours. Don't forget to share this amongst your friends and family. And also, please uh, follow us also in Over a Glass or Two, our, uh, our socials in Facebook, YouTube, Instagram. And also, watch us in uh, ABS-CBN's FYE channel in Kumu. Thank you, mga Kumunizens. And also, always watch us in TFC, the Filipino channel. And you can also stream us on I Want TFC. Yes. Miss Lloyda mm-hmm. Nicholas Lewis. Yes. Our inspiration. Thank you for being our Phil M. Fairy Godmother. Thank you for always yes, being there for salamat. us. Yes, And being a guide and, you, you, you know, to everyone, the Filipinos here in the U.S. and globally as well. And thank you for this new inspiration of a book that you have. Yes, maraming salamat, Miss Ayan, Lloyd. Mag, 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 let's have a last toast for this morning, night, yes, guys. Yes, 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 God, yes. Miss yes. Lloyd and everyone, <laughs> mga kaugat, amidst the challenges of life, let's still find ways to be happy. Let's all talk about it. Over, Over a, a glass, glass or, or two. two. Good night, Miss Lloyd. Good night, Miss Lloyd. Thank you. Maraming salamat. Guys, please don't forget to buy the book. Thank you, guys. Thank you.